brought to you by GTA. We start with you. Elvira Cagle doesn't usually go out much except for twice a week. Thursdays are reserved for ladies' Bible study, and Fridays she gets her hair done. So when she suddenly fell ill, she thought it was just a cold. Usually what I grab is Zycam, and I take that during two tablets, in the morning it was gone. And then it still wasn't back to normal. But it was anything but normal. A trip to the clinic, a nasal swab, and results returned from a lab in Hawaii. And then they called and they said I was positive. I mean, I could have dropped the phone. Cagle's daughter, Jackie Nagencast, was in complete shock. Something's come into our lives that I didn't want. There was fear, anxiety, and a whole lot of prayer. You know, you do your best and know God does the rest, and so it's ultimately in his hands. And while they were relying on a higher power, his angels on the ground with public health were there every step of the way during home isolation. We knew if I did really something happen quickly, we had somebody to, to get in touch with. So really appreciated the, the girls in the health office that were calling it trying to be of help if we needed it. My mom got two calls every day, morning and afternoon, to see how she was doing. The rest of us each got our own phone call to see how we were doing, always reassuring us what to do in case we had any symptoms, what to do if my mom's system, symptoms grew worse. And so we always were in the know, and we were always very supported by a group of people who were there for us at just a phone call away. At 92 years old, Elvira is a survivor, a testament that with faith and support that you can fight and beat COVID. This was the first adventure of us for us and I, even, I didn't hear of anybody else going through it so we could go to somebody else that had experience to you know. And it, it was new and, and it was an unchartered journey. <laughs> Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Sabrina Salas, Matanani. Brought to you by GTA. We start with you.